Hi everyone, and I, today I'm going to be talking about how you can find June bugs. I, there's three right here, so there's one over here, there's one stuck upside down, and another one just chilling on the screen. They are attracted like that, lights like other insects, so they you can normally find them under like a porch light or something like that. They are clumsy, so they do get stuck upside down every once in a while. And this is the most common June bug we I have around my house, and it's the ten line June bug. Males have larger antennas than females do. It is true that they do have 10 lines on their back. At the end of their legs, each of their leg has a hook on the end that they can hold on to. But sometimes they would fall off accidentally. They would rather be on something that has grip than something that doesn't. So that, so it's, to me, it's hard to get them off me. This guy is on the screen, so he has enough grip, and it'll be really hard to pull him off. To with them, um, how I pick them up to let them go, because right, sometimes when they do that, they just fall on the ground. I actually put them like on my leg or something. Then I try to pull them off so I can, like, so I can, like, almost, like, toss them into a tree, like I do here. This is an example of their hooks. They have really strong legs, so it's really hard to get them off, like, your shorts or shirt. When I let them go, I normally throw them into, like, a tree or something. Because if if they are like mid air, they normally open their wings and fly. And if they don't, they would fall into the tree. They have fuzz under them, and it's on their thorax. The head is right there, above, and there's there's a shot of the antennas right there. The females will have antennas about three times smaller than these antennas. That's about it. So, see you next time. Don't forget to check the link in the description. And don't forget to check sheets for cockroaches.